But see, the thing about Kevin Samuels that, that you all don't know is that his, his vision, his legacy was going to expound, expand past YouTube. He, he had visions of, of starting a, um, a, a mega sort of entertainment uh, advertising where we would talk about men's clothing, fitness, um, suits, cologne, those colognes and things that he would advertise. Mm -hmm. He was doing that because he was getting paid for it. He was a brilliant businessman. And the fact that he was willing to speak the truth to people and was accurate about it, all that did was endear him to the rest of us who recognized the truth he was speaking. So for those people who are his detractors, listen to the man's podcast and you'll see he was speaking the truth. It's the reality that we live in now. Now, one of the things you said was he was talking about getting yourself together, staying in shape, and that's one of the things he did, and that's why this is so shocking to so many people, cardiac arrest, heart attack, and people are trying to wrap their heads around that. This is a man who taught, uh, who taught many people uh, how to live better, how to eat better, and so it's kind of like, how did this happen to him? Well, you know, unfortunately, um, he basically was a one-man show. You know, every night for the past seven years, most of you all didn't know him until about two and a half years ago. But for the first five years, he spoke to men. He said, you need to get yourself together. You, you're five foot five, uh, 280 pounds, and you only make $30,000 a year, yet you want this supermodel to be your woman. That's not going to happen. And he was see, cruel. You want to see cruelty? <laughs> Look at how he <laughs> talked to some of those guys. <laughs> I mean, 